Hello everyone. In today's session, I'll discuss about WLC, also known as Wireless LAN Controller. Today's session will cover following topics. What is WLC? What is the role and function of WLC or why are they required? Protocol used by WLC. A wireless LAN controller is a network device that manages wireless network access points that allow wireless devices to connect to the network. So what is the role and function of WLC or why are they required? We have so many wireless devices nowadays which access wireless network or internet. We have almost become accustomed to expect wireless connection wherever we go. In your organization, you certainly have more than one access point. You will have it in every room or on every floors or probably have them in different buildings. And in very large organization, they could be even at different locations. When we look at large enterprise network, a single access point is not enough. Imagine a network with thousands of users. You might have tens or even hundreds of access points that, ha that you have to manage and to take care of. And of course, all of this access point has to be administrated and you may need to make configuration changes or update security policies on those access points. When you walk around the office, you want seamless connectivity and don't want to get disconnected every time when your wireless device switches from one access point to another. You want to have a stable wireless connection wherever you go. Switching seamlessly from one access point to another is called roaming. This all requirement can be met by using a single device called wireless LAN controller. It is usually a software loaded on one of your servers or it is an appliance like this one that centralizes the management of these access points. Some people call this as a single pane of glass. Like I can go to one screen and I could see everything happening with my wireless access points. By using WLCs, all management tasks are moved from access point to the wireless LAN controller. It takes care of authentication, roaming, creating new wireless networks, etc. This also makes it very easy to deploy new access point as you don't have to do any special configuration. You simply plug in the access point into the network and the wireless controllers controller takes it from there and allows to configure everything from the central point. If you do need to make any configuration change or something across all of your access point, you can do it in one place on a single wireless controller and that wireless controller will push the configuration change to all of your access point of course. The main objective of the WLC or wireless LAN controller is to be able to centralize all the control of the access points. The access points are now responsible for just forwarding traffic. We call these access points as light weight access points or LWAPs. The wireless controller can also provide statistics and performance information so you will know exactly how well your wireless network is running. Most wireless networks have some type of reporting mechanism so that you can get long term information about how well your wireless network is running. With all those features I can say by using WLC's APs are easy to access, easy to manage and error free. So what protocols does WLC uses to manage APs? It is called as LWAPP, Lightweight Access Point Protocol which is used on in between WLC and AP to manage access points in large quantities by the network administrator or network operations center. WLC is regarded as one of the important elements of wireless network that is quick and effective. I would like to end by sharing one interesting fact about WLC. Despite being called a wireless LAN controller, a WLC is connected to the wired LAN and to the light access point by lightweight access point by wires. The WLC does not have any wireless connection. That's all for today's session. In my next video, I'll be discussing about Cisco DNA Center controller. If you like this video, please do like and share and subscribe and hit the bell icon. Thank you.